my YouTube family and friends, all of you who have supported me, who have believed in me, who have encouraged me. This morning I come to you with a little walk down memory lane. I want you to look at this picture of me now. And I want you to take a walk back with me to see where it all began. This picture right here tells you that it can be done. If you believe, you will achieve. And if you put in the hard work, you will see that in the end, it will work out one pound at a time. So let's become a stronger, better us. One pound at a time. No surgeries, no chaos, no hardcore diets that throw you back into oblivion. Just walk, move, change your diet. Change your diet. You cannot walk for 15 or 20 minutes and then continue to eat the same things. So please remember, in order to become a stronger, better you, one pound at a time, let's give up a little something. Let's change a little something so that in the end, it will pay off. So let's take a trip back to when I was sitting in the chair moving until I was able to get up and move. And you will see Miss Bev as natural as it could be then. A lot of extra pounds, no makeup, no nothing, just the raw, naked Miss Bev. So good morning, my YouTube channel fans and well-wishers. Today is Saturday, it's my Sabbath. And, um, but this morning I got up and I walked and I came back and I, I feel so good. And I have talked about this journey. And again, I have to remind the people that I have found these little videos, um, encouraging or motivating that, um, again, it's one pound at a time. Do not get frustrated. Do not become overwhelmed. It's a little journey and it's your personal journey. The things I'm doing, I'm enjoying it. It's not something that I'm like, oh my God, not again. It, I want to do it. And this morning as I was walking back with my neighbor, I thought about um, the first time when I started in March and when I did my music the musical part to what helps me because when i walk in the in the mornings i don't feel like that's enough sometimes and so i'm in here i love to sing that's my best part of of worship the singing i love music and i usually love a quiet hymn but i find that when we walk i would play my music in on my phone and i gravitate to the um, the, the revival kind of gospel music. It does something to the bones. It makes you want to get up and move. And so in the beginning, when I started, you saw me sitting in my chair and I was just moving, just moving. But today I want you to see the improvements I've made over the months and to let you know that you can do it. I am not showing, um, I don't want you to look at this fat lady and oh my God, I want you to look at where I was and where I am now. I want you to see the progress I've been making. I want you to see the positives in what I'm doing. I know many people, they get disgusted because people are fat and it's oh my God, ew. But again, we have accomplished much. We have done a lot of great things. We're filled with greatness and goodness and love. Um, and so... Don't let anyone take away that joy from you. You love who you are. Being fat doesn't make you an evil person. Being fat doesn't make you um, so gross that if somebody needs a cup of tea, you're saying, mm, I'm not doing it. We are still human beings and we must, if we don't love ourselves, then we can't expect others to love us. So you love yourself. Be proud of yourself. Um... Take good care of yourself and just let's do this together one moment at a time, 
one step at a time as we lose one pound at a time. All right? We're going to become stronger to be and better as we lose this weight and inches together. Because again, remember, we're not just going to lose pounds. We're going to be losing inches. So I'm going to start off with some um, Joan Fleming's. Um, I have used this before and I didn't see any copyrights on it. So I'm going to do this again. And then you will see me move into my soaker. I used to be able to do one, <laughs> one 10 minute soaker, but now I'm doing two of them. So let me, let me show you now that I'm not sitting in the chair and moving anymore. I'm up on my feet and I am moving. So dance with me, please.
my family, my friends, you just saw the transformation. Now I'm begging you, please get up and move. Get up and move. Find your favorite songs. That Byron Lee medley for me, the songs touches my soul. I enjoy them. And so it motivates me to get up and move when I hear them. And I play them often. I know that I checked and there's no, there is no copyright issues there. So don't worry. I did check. But please move. Um, when it comes to walking or even for your dancing, invest in a decent pair of shoes. When your feet are happy, they'll take you places you'll never understand. Invest. I invest in Clark's. You don't have to do Clark's. You can find any shoe. Just about any shoes that fits comfortably. Because again, if your shoes fit comfortably, you it will take you places, more places and more places. So again, please commit yourselves to this. One pound at a time to become a stronger, better you. Just do it. Just move. Because it's in the movement that we will be able to shed the pound.